Okay, today I'm going to teach you how to use a protractor to measure angles. But before that, you will need to learn how to read the numbers on your protractor. Your protractor has two scales, the inner scale and the outer scale. This is the inner scale, the numbers on the inside. And this is the outer scale, the numbers on the outside. Okay? Now, the inner scale. The numbers on the inner scale begins here. 0, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. And it goes on until 180. This means that the inner scale, the 0, starts on the right-hand side. Now, the outer scale, the 0, starts on the left side. So, for the outer scale, 0 is here. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, and it goes on until 180. Alright, so the difference between the inner scale and the outer scale is that 0 starts on the inside for the inner uh, on the right hand side for the inner scale, and 0 starts on the left hand side on the outer scale. Okay, now how do I read the numbers then? And how do I read all these lines? Okay, let's say I'm measuring an angle from using the outer scale. Alright, now, this is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. You notice that Multiples of 5, the lines are longer. Okay, the, the number 5 line is longer. Alright, so the outer scale is easy to read. You just look at the number and count the lines. Okay, the inner scale is slightly more difficult. Okay, 0 is here. This is 10. How do you read the numbers in between? Let's say I want to read number 6. Alright, how do I read number 6? Okay. You will need to look at the lines here. Okay? You will need to look at the lines here. You do not look at the number here. You look at the number on the inner scale and count the lines here. For example, this is 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6 will be here. 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay? This is not 170. This is 10 because I'm reading from the inner scale. Okay, again, let's try. Let's say I'm reading from the inner scale and I want 54. Inner scale, 0, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54. 54 will be here. Okay. So that means that if you are reading the numbers from the inner scale, the inside you can ignore all the numbers on the outside all right and same thing if you are reading the numbers on the outer scale you can ignore all the numbers on the inner scale you only use one scale at a time all right next we'll take a look at how to measure angles using a protractor